Welcome to Dollar Store Gaming, this is Bootumba. Normally 99 cents, purchased for 54. <laughs> discount, 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 Shrek, is that you? So, first thing to note, by the way, if the recording looks a little weird, that's because there's no way to actually do a game capture or window capture on this game. So I have to actually capture my entire display and crop it. Is this Comic Sans? Tutorial. Wow, look at this animation. Left right to move, up to jump, space to hit. Swordsman not attack Patumba, but simply trying to run into the cave and steal the princess. N ninja? What? Why is there so much to consider? Okay, let's see this. Well, this used to be a mobile game. Let's go. Did I win? What am I supposed to do? I'm confused. I thought I was defending the cave. I thought... What? I'm so confused. I thought I was defending the cave. Why is there... Okay. Someone went in there. Why is the number doing that? What possible reason could the number have for doing that? So, somebody made a Newgrounds game and decided, I'm gonna sell this. Oh boy. Bonk. That is an off- You're just repeating this, aren't you? That is an awfully victorious sound for what I just did. Is it gonna repeat again? God damn it. Okay. This is the same level? Behold gameplay. I don't think I've ever been more bored in my life. Okay. Oh wow, I unlocked the next level. Why, it looks remarkably similar to level one. You ever been so unbelievably bored you can't even think of things to say? Just, just wondering that in general. Guys, I think I'm stuck in a time loop. Is this all there is then? I feel like I could program this game. I don't know anything about programming or game design. Certainly not. I mean, I guess I know more about game design than the people who made this, clearly, but still. I, for one, am glad they're playing that sound effect every five seconds. It really adds a lot to the game. Has there been any variance to these levels at all? <laughs> There hasn't, has there? Every single level has been the same. Thrill as every couple seconds you hit the space bar! Hey. Sometimes, I wonder why I do dollar store gaming. Then a game like this comes along. And it makes me wonder why I do it even harder. Can I skip levels? Oh my god! There's no variance. There's no change. This is- this is it. This is literally everything. There's probably gonna be some more enemies later, but this is it. I guess the enemies are coming slightly faster, maybe? Question mark? I'm out of things to say. Completely and totally. There's nothing else I can talk about. The background music is... I can't even finish that sentence. I thought of jokes, I thought of describing the sounds directly, but now the background music is. I have been playing this for eight minutes. That's eight minutes I could spend doing literally anything else. Anything else would be better than this. Does clicking do anything? It mutes the game. That's so much nicer. Oh my god. I'm so glad I discovered that now. So, the question is, is Batumbo worth a dollar? What do you think? Look at this. The gameplay is entirely you hit spacebar every couple seconds. This is absolute trash. This is a game that would be laughed off of Newgrounds, and they're selling it. Oh, look, a new enemy type slightly. It only took 10 minutes of gameplay. It's rare that I do this, but I'm probably gonna get a refund for this game. Cause I've literally seen everything. Use your money to buy almost anything else on Steam, really. Because the story of Batumba, as shocking as this may be, 
isn't very exciting. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to subscribe if you want to see more regular gaming content, including new episodes of Dollar Store Gaming, Game Boy Roulette, and 10 Things You Missed. Thanks again, I'm Brian J, and I will see you next time.